हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू सी सेट मंत्रा वेलकम टू डेली डोस ऑफ सॉल्व क्वेश्चन फॉर मोर सॉल्व क्वेश्चन एंड कॉन्सेप्ट प्लीज ज्वाइन अवर टेलीग्राम चैनल टू एनरोल इन अवर कोर्स काइंडली विजिट सी सेट मंत्रा डॉट कॉम बोथ द लिंक्स आर गिवन बिलो इन द डिस्क्रिप्शन ये मनी लेंडर फाइंड दैट ड्यू टू फॉल इन द एनुअल रेट ऑफ इंटरेस्ट एट परसेंट टू सेवन थ्री बाई फोर परसेंट हिस्स ईयरली इनकम डिमिनेश बाई सिक्सटी वन पॉइंट फाइव जीरो रुपीज हिस्स कैपिटल इज वेरी सिंपल क्वेश्चन फ्रॉम इंटरेस्ट चैप्टर बेस्ड ऑन सिंपल इंटरेस्ट कॉन्सेप्ट वी नो सिंपल इंटरेस्ट एस आई इज इक्वल टू पी एन आर बाई हंड्रेड नो चेंज इन सिंपल इंटरेस्ट माई फ्रेंड्स ओके वेन प्रिंसिपल एंड नंबर ऑफ इयर्स इज कॉन्स्टेंट एंड वेन रेट ऑफ इंटरेस्ट इज चेंजिंग देन चेंज इन सिंपल इंटरेस्ट इज इक्वल पी एन डेल्टा आर बाई हंड्रेड माई फ्रेंड्स ओके दिस चेंज इज हैपनिंग ओनली बिकॉज ऑफ चेंज इन रेट ऑफ इंटरेस्ट ओके P and N are constant here. Similarly, when P and R are constant and number of years are changing, in that case, change in simple interest is equal P delta N R by hundred. Again, when N and R are constant, principal is changing. In that case, change in simple interest is equal delta P N R by hundred. Here any two quantities are remaining constant and one quantity is changing, my friends. Okay, in that case, we'll write the change in simple interest like this, my friends. In this problem, rate of interest is changing, my friends. So we'll be using this formula. So delta R is eight minus seven three by four. Okay, eight minus seven three by four. This is one by four percentage, my friends. Now, when this change happens, his yearly income diminishes by okay. So number of years is one. Income diminishes by sixty one and a half rupees, my friends. Income means the interest which he is getting on the capital, okay. So that is change in simple interest, my friends. Okay, diminishing that means change. So what is that sixty one point five zero? now we are asked to find the capital my friends okay p we do not know that now putting all these values in this equation change in simple interest that is 61.50 p we do not know n is 1 delta r 1 by 4 by 100 my friends okay so p by 4 okay p into 1 into 1 by 4 is p by 4 Now hundred into sixty one point five zero. That is sixty one five zero. Now this implies P is equal four into six one five zero. Okay, four six za twenty four thousand four one za four hundred. So twenty four thousand four hundred four five za two hundred. So that is a twenty four thousand six hundred, my friends. Okay. so our answer is c here understanding these simple concepts is very important my friends problems are not complicated okay if you understand the concept well you can solve any problem my friends okay now kindly solve this problem we have solved similar problem on 11th february my friends link to that problem is given below in the description kindly watch it we'll post the solution to this question in our telegram channel in the morning To know more about the course, kindly visit csetmantra.com. If you have any queries, feel free to call us or mail us. Thank you.